In the 1600s, the Netherlands was one of the wealthiest nations in Europe, a center of trade and art. But around 1634, something unexpected happened, a frenzy over flowers. This is the story of tulip mania, the world's first economic bubble. The tulip, originally from Central Asia, was introduced to Europe in the late 1500s. It quickly became a symbol of luxury and wealth, especially in the Netherlands. Tulips were prized for their vibrant colors and unique patterns, thanks to a virus that caused exotic streaks on the petals. As demand grew, tulips became the ultimate status symbol, and prices began to rise. By the early 1630s, the market for tulips was in full bloom. People from all walks of life, from wealthy merchants to common tradesmen, invested in tulip bulbs. The prices reached incredible heights. Some bulbs were worth as much as a luxurious house in Amsterdam. This craze even led to a futures market, where people traded tulips that hadn't yet bloomed, hoping to make a profit. The tulip craze took over society. Stories spread of people selling entire estates for a single bulb. The obsession for tulips crossed all social classes, everyone wanted a piece of the booming market. Speculation ran wild, and people borrowed large sums of money, convinced that the tulip prices would only continue to rise. The bubble kept inflating, with no sign of stopping. But as with all bubbles, this one eventually burst. In 1637, buyers suddenly vanished, and the demand for tulips collapsed. Prices plummeted overnight, leaving many in ruin. Some lost their life savings, while others faced debt they couldn't repay. The crash sent shockwaves across the Dutch economy, bringing an end to the flower frenzy.